this is number six, the sixth item in our discussion of waves. We discussed the uh, normal modes on the string. So they were like this, just f uh, fit uh, integer number of bubbles into this uh, length, etc. Now, this is, here's an interesting uh, problem. Suppose you play the string in such a way that there is a point P such that this is a node, namely uh, this is a node. There are two nodes here, okay? not counting the zero and L in between. And if this is a node, so P will be a node, we play a normal mode in which P is a node and the question is what is the minimum uh, frequency produced by this way of playing the string if this distance is d1 if this distance is d2 d1 plus d2 is the full length and if d1 over d2 is n1 over n2 and if these are integers and if no further simplification possible. So n1, n2 are integers. No further simplification. Simplification for n1 over n2. For example, it may be 3 over 2, but not uh, 6 over 4. 6 over 4 can be reduced into 3 over 2. So if, if it is uh, like this, then uh, let n be n1 plus n2. And you can fit here n lambda n over 2. That's equal to F. So the frequency, the lowest frequency, will be n times the fundamental. n1 plus n2 F1. This, this will be the lowest. Uh, so, for example, let's take... Uh, 2 and 3. Let's take them as 2 and 3. That means uh, here is P, 0, and 2. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So this is P, 2 bubbles here and 3 bubbles there. So obviously, this is uh, f uh, the frequency of it is f1. The lowest frequency heard in this case will be five times f1. The next frequency heard, the next frequency produced. Remember, the condition is that p always remains as a uh, uh, as a node. So the next frequency is that. Uh, higher normal modes, the first high, uh, mode that will have P as a node again. So that's uh, nothing but F2 is 2F1. F3 is equal to 3F1. So it goes. Now it turns out uh, on a guitar, this has a uh, application. You play harmonics, namely you play a higher harmonic d directly without uh, playing the fundamental or the first, har uh, second harmonic, etc. If you are playing a higher harmonic, you can filter out the earlier uh, lower harmonics and start uh, with this one. 
And apparently, uh, in music, this uh, is a good. Uh, this is producing interesting sounds during the mu music. So let me just uh, consider a guitar string and uh, discuss the uh, harmonics, and then we will uh, display it uh, on the guitar. So this is harmonics on a guitar string. In fact, this is the topic of this uh, discussion. So here is the guitar. It has six uh, strings and the lowest uh, uh, pitch uh, is F. E3. Now let us uh, produce harmonics. For example, we begin the first one. P is in the middle. So this is in the ratio of 1 and 1. So the lowest frequency produced will be 2F1. This is F1. So it is 2 F E3, which is F E4. So, point P, where is it on the uh, guitar string? It turns out this is at the 12th fret. So at the 12th fret, if you put your finger, you play it and you immediately take your finger out, because other, otherwise, you know, you'll be playing a string with half uh, as long. The whole string will uh, oscillate, but P will be node. Of course, you can't do it perfectly, it's approximately. And you will hear uh, an F of E4. That's one. Okay. Uh, this uh, string is the uh, sixth uh, string, and it is E3. It's playing E of the third uh, octave. And uh, the length of this uh, string is about 66 to 60, 66 centimeters plus. And uh, the fundamental is E3. Now, we, if we divide, if we put the point P in the middle, so we divided 1 and 1, we divided into 2 and that means frequency is increased by 2. So I will be playing the FE4, the second harmonic. And to divide by 2, I place my finger on the 12th uh, fret, which divides the string in 2. So, and I will also play the E4 and check whether they sound similar. Once more. Two. Let's play uh, this is P. So uh, let's divide it one and 2. And the fret, frets are these things, these are called frets. And we count uh, this way. This is the seventh fret. What is the uh, note, musical note? So it is uh, F1 is 3F1. It is 3, 2 times 2 F1. This is an octave above. F1 is FE3. So this is 3 over 2 F 
and this is uh, again se uh, semitones. This is a perfect fifth higher than E4. So let me just draw the scale again. E, F, G, A, B. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We started from E4. So that for this is F of B4. So if you put your finger on the seventh fret uh, plate and then lift uh, of your finger, you are playing F of B4. Namely, you have suppressed uh, we have suppressed the lower uh, harmonics. For example, we are not playing this. Now we divided uh, point P such that uh, the string with point P such that uh, the ratio is one to two. So that uh, means the seventh uh, fret, and the uh, harmonic plays uh, B4. I will also play B4 to see that they are quite similar. Once more. Three. P. So it we have one and we have three. So it is four total. So the fret uh, that goes with it is uh, five. Let me write here, fret. 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 Now what is the note uh, played? F1 is four Fe3. This is two times two, so it is two octaves above. So it is F of E3, E4, E5. So you are playing F of E5. One, two, three. That means uh, the fifth fret. And I am playing then E5. Once more. Four. P could be here. One and let me do it like this. One and you see, uh, you put here uh, bubbles, uh, but it could have been two and three also. Two, three, or three and two. Three and two. So whether P is here or P is there or P is there, it will produce the same uh, same note. And what is that note? Uh, it is five times F one is five F E three. So I divide by four, multiply by four. This is five over four times four F E three. This is F of E4, E5, two octaves above, E5. 5 over 4 says uh, go a major third. This is a major third. And in the equally tempered scale, the good approximation to it is four semitones. So if it is uh, E, F, G, G sharp. So one, two, three, four. So this is F of G5 sharp. Two 
two to three. So it is uh, the fifth harmonic, which corresponds to uh, G5 sharp. Once more. Five. P one. And five. So the fret uh, that goes uh, with it is, uh, for example, this would be uh, ninth ninth fret. This this will be the fourth fret. This would be ninth fret here. This would be this would be too far ahead three. So nine and four. So this one. 6 F1 is 6 F1. So it is uh, 3 times, this is 2, F of E3, F of E4, times 2 times 2. So it is 3 over 2, F of E5. And perfect fifth ahead F of E5 after seven semitones is F of B5. Okay. Again, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, and uh, this is the fret uh, three. Okay. The ratio one to five. And the fret is the third one. It will uh, play, the harmonic is, uh, the sixth harmonic will play uh, B5. Once more. 